a mean some bitch, but he taught me respect. Earl like Jane could learn a thing or two about that. I like her. Just give her some time. Maybe you're right. Hell, I didn't know what to make of Lee first. Of course, he helped me and mine more times than I can remember. Jane helped us back on the road. All right, All right. Give, it give it a turn. Oh. We're so close, Clem. With a little bit of luck, I can get this thing running. And then we can get out on the road and really make some distance. Wellington's got to be out there. Those rumors can't all be bunk. I mean, hell, there's got to be something out here other than snow and goddamn Euro trash. Sounds good to me. We're gonna make it, Clem. I know it. All right, turn it again. Did you turn, Did you turn it? it? Yes. Ah, damn it! We'll get it working. We gotta get moving if we're gonna keep AJ alive. We're running out of time. I gotta get this thing to start. Gonna try warming up the battery. Born inside. I don't like leaving him with that girl. Yeah. Need any help? I'm fine. Go check on AJ. I said I got this, okay? Go on inside, Go on inside and see if the baby, baby needs anything. Wish they'd finished this place. Looks like it's about to collapse. Looks broken. Busted. One. Yeah. What? Nah, I'm fine. No thanks. Do you remember when you saw me first? Back at the lodge? Took one look at me and hell no, she ain't coming inside. I liked you from the start. Well, you looked a bit pissed. Even if it's something you knew you had to do. Go on. You can be honest. All the time. Yeah. You know, I'll say one thing about Luke. No matter where you end up, there's always one bad seed rocking the boat. But I don't think he would have ever been that guy. Let me ask you something, Clem. When's the last time anyone did what you wanted? Huh? 
I think people respect me. Really? I think so. Well, good for you, honey. You know, I've been all over, run with a lot of people, a lot of men, and listen to a lot of promises. Ain't one of them come true. I'm starting to think there might be another way, you know? I'm gonna go take a piss. Okay. <laughs> And Arvo wouldn't shut up, so I moved him in here. I've seen that look before. Son of a bitch. Oh, damn it. I've seen it too. A few times. Then you know what's about to happen. I know Kenny's a nice guy, Clem. I bet Carver was a nice guy, too. Once. Probably had a nice job, and a nice pretty wife. But then all this happened. And one day, he caved some kid's face in and realized he could sleep at night. Oh, whoa. Oh. Kenny isn't Carver. He just made a mistake. All I'm saying is, start thinking about what happens if you're wrong. You two have known each other a long time. Sooner or later, you're gonna have to decide how much that's worth. I think it needs food or something. Seems like you've done that before. There's no rocket science. You wanna try? No way. It's gonna puke. Clem, no. Hold it like this. Hey. Hello. Hi. That's Hi. My name's Jane. I think it's gonna puke. It's not gonna puke. <laughs> it pukes. It pukes. It pukes. Why is there piercing no black? Black goo. What the heck? <laughs> There's not much left. I was running with some people a long time ago, down near D.C. Some guy got trapped in the middle of a crosswalk. Can't remember his name. He used to call me Mary Jane. He was a douchebag. Anyway, the dick got stuck under a car hiding from a dozen walkers. One after another, they went down. Is this Spider-Man? Lost four people before we got him out. Showing about. So we made it. Didn't find out till later he was already bit. Turned and ripped the neck right out of this old lady. The look on her face was she was just staring up at the sky, like she was watching a bird. Look, Clem. He got it working. Works? But I tell you. So what's the plan? How much food do we have? At least a week. And for the baby? Not much. We need to find a place for the baby. Yeah, some place warm. I agree. We should head back south. What? We're kind of freeze to death. 
I don't know whose stupid idea it was to march up here in the first place, but it was a bad one. She's right. What if we went back to house? Wait, what? Fuck that. I was thinking more like Texas. Texas? The fuck? It was just an idea. <laughs> we already talked about this. I'm sorry. Yeah. We did? We're going to find Wellington. Right, Clem? And he doesn't like Texas. Kenny, it's freezing up here, man. It's only gonna get worse. We came this far. We're not going back. Nah, man, this is fucking nuts. I'm with Kenny. We should head north. Goddamn right. Clem, my friend Krista, she told me about Wellington a long time ago, Jade. It's out there. Look, I don't give two shits about what you think. I got this truck working, so I say where we go, and we're heading fucking north. It's the best chance we got to help an agent. What? What? Who? Oh, the Rusty? Yeah, he ain't coming with us. You're just gonna leave him here? I don't give a good goddamn where he goes. He's done. He could die. Better him than another one of us. We have to bring him with us. Oh. He knows the area. He can help us. Oh yeah, some help he's been. He got Luke killed. I ain't gonna say he helped the situation. But maybe if you eased up on him before, he wouldn't have run away in the first place. You ever think about that, Kenny? Either way, I'm not going anywhere in the middle of the night. Yeah, me neither. There could be a herd out there. You want that child's blood on your hands, Mike? We're all gonna die out here if you don't calm the fuck down, Kenny. Haven't we been through enough for one day? Jesus fucking Christ. Remember the last time we had a working car and sat around on our asses, Clem? I'm going inside. Damn it. Kenny, are you okay? Uh huh? What's in the lock? Hmm. What's in the office, honey? You better talk some sense into him. For his sake. to wander around in the woods. They ought to be scared of more than me. Did you hear me? We're all scared. Look, we got maybe a day's worth of food for that kid left. That's it. Clem, think about Rebecca and Alvin. I mean, what if Lee hadn't gone tearing across half of Georgia looking for you? A lot of folks died to make that happen. A lot of folks died to get us this far. We owe it to them to see this done. Maybe he shouldn't have. Don't you say that. I ought to slap you. Whoa. You know what he sacrificed for you? What I did? That means something, damn it. He ought to slap me. I wish Lee was here. <laughs> What'd you think he'd say? He did die for Clementine, though. up on this kid. I mean, what's the point of going on after that? That's what people like Lee do, and what people like Jane won't ever understand. That's true. Look, I know Wellington might be bullshit, but where there's smoke, there's fire. Krista heard about it too, right? You know, when I first saw you back at that lodge, I thought I was dreaming. That guys. And when you sat with those people at dinner, well, 
I knew you were growing up. And yeah, I felt sad, but also pride. Pride I hadn't felt in a long time. But I need you now, Clem. There have to be folks doing better than us. It's the only chance that child has. Something has to be out here. We'll find it, Kenny. I knew I could count on you, Clem. Look, we'll figure everything out in the morning. Come on, let's get some sleep. So we gotta be ready. And I still feel pain here. What? Hold. What the hell is going on here? Who's there? My shit. What the hell is going on here? Why is he doing? Shit. Mike. What are you doing? I got the rest of it. Bonnie. <laughs> wow. What the hell is wrong with this guy? I never got sick, but my brother always had something. 
He's going to die. I know it. You don't know that? I feel bad. Why? I called him a crybaby when I hid the bug in his pillow. Oh, that's okay, honey. You didn't mean it. Lee? Hmm? Why did Lily do that to Doug? I don't know. She was sad, Pam. That can make people angry sometimes. Have you ever been that angry? One time. Well, Whatever, guys. <laughs> don't always make sense. How come? Because bad things happen to everyone. And it's hard to keep being yourself after they do. What do you think? Should we have left her behind? I don't know. I don't know. <sighs> I don't either. I don't know if we did the right thing. How can you tell? Well, it's not like math, Claire. Sometimes it just isn't the right answer. I hate math. <laughs> Me too, sweet pea. Part of growing up is doing what's best for the people you care about. Even if sometimes that means hurting someone else. I don't want to hurt anyone. It's not that easy. Why does Clementine sound a bit older in this? What can I do you to make it better? You won't leave me. Oh, I wouldn't do that. I promise. Everything's gonna be all right. Even though, even though she's the one that left you, and you want to save her. Well, let's try to get some sleep. From the shock. We've been worried as hell. What happened? That piece of shit, Rusty, shot you. We had to run the truck to keep you warm. How do you feel? It hurts. Couldn't find the bullet. Must have gone clean through. It'll burn a while, but you'll be fine. Those sons of bitches. I mean, I expected it from the Russian, but Mike? I could tell they were working on something. I didn't think they'd go that far. Yeah, well, who would steal our food and shoot a kid? Should have thrown in with trash like that in the first place. Is Bonnie okay? They took off on foot. Didn't get this puppy thanks to you. Now that Clem's awake, we should talk about where we're going. We're headed north. What, to find Wellington? You sure talk a lot of shit, but you got a better plan? We head south, back to house. Carver's camp? 
What the fuck what kind of plan is that? that? I think Bonnie I said there was more formula back there. And we and actually know where it is. And it was overrun by a damn herd. The walkers should be gone by now. It's miles in the other direction. I don't care where we go. Just please, stop arguing. She's the one that's going off. Because you won't listen to a thing I'm saying. What's that? You're talking into my bad ear, sweetheart. Jackass. Oh, I still can't hear you. Look, even if there is some place up here, it could take us weeks to find it. We could get back to Howe's in a day. Tell you what, we can turn around just as soon as you pry this wheel from my cold, dead fingers. How's that sound? Whatever. I give up. Get your feet off the dash. Let's play a game, Clem. I spy, with my little eye, an asshole. Your turn. Grow up. Go to hell. I'll pull this fucking car over. Go ahead. You wanna die out here? Better than waiting to die next to you. Both being children. Me? I couldn't see the damn road. Bet you're having trouble seeing a lot of things these days. You shut oh. your fucking mouth. I am done playing games with you, Jay. Fuck you. You don't know a damn thing about me. I know exactly what you are. Nothing. Nobody cares about you. And you don't care about nobody but yourself. That makes you nothing. What is it with you? It's your family, right? Don't. It is, it is, isn't it? I'm warning you, little shit. You're just another type A asshole trying to save a bunch of dead people. Don't you fucking talk about them! This isn't the time for this. No, this is exactly the time for this. You listen to me. You mouth off about my family, and I will fucking end you. Jesus Christ, I'm so sick of this wounded warrior crap. Just pull over! I can't take this. What? Running away again? What a fucking shock. In the end, still only care about yourself, right? And where were and you where when you Sarita, Sarita died, died, Kenny? Oh. Huh? huh? Where were you? I was there. I couldn't. God damn you, I love that woman! Who could love you? Look at you. You can't raise this kid. It's scared to death of you. I got this way, saving your ass from that hellhole. And I would have left you to rot if I'd known what you were. Jane, Kenny loved Sarita. Of course he did. He loves having anyone around that does what he says. That's why he loves this kid so much. Can't talk about <laughs> you know the you thing about people, about people like you, Kenny? Kenny? You're just a bomb, bomb waiting to go off. Everyone, Everyone talks about you behind your back because they're afraid, they're afraid of you. That ain't true. Mike, Mike, Bonnie, Bonnie Sarita? Sarita? Fucking liar, that ain't, that ain't true. true! Everyone around you knows that sooner or later, they're gonna end up dead. Sarita knew it, I know it, and so does Clementine. I told you not to talk about my family! Fuck you! Fucking piece of shit! Go to hell, you son of a bitch! Jesus! You okay? I'm fine. How's AJ? He's fine. fine. Sure. sure. Yes. yes. Clem, you alright? Yeah. Penny, yeah. I'm... Wait, hold on. Go around. One of them might have diesel. We shouldn't stop here. We're running on fumes. Got no choice. When I holler, it's okay. Drive up closer. Anything happens, I'll try to meet you there. Right? If you're going, go now. Kenny! Fucking asshole. God! I can't do this anymore. I'm serious, Clem. I tried, but I just can't. No, you're making him mad. Making him mad. Everything, Everything makes him mad. How are you not seeing that? Well, all you're doing is just making it worse. Mm. You're just like him. Clem, we could leave. Right now. Are you serious? What about AJ? Look, I, I know you're close to him, but Kenny would never let him go. This is our chance, Clem. Don't you ever want to know what it's like to live your own life? Oh no. It's snowing. Why are they moving? They must not be cold enough yet. Fuck. Get us out of here. I don't know how to drive. <laughs> she, she doesn't have any driver license. She's 11 and she's driving? What? Is that evil? Oh, wow! <laughs> oh, God. Get out of here! The door is stuck! Shit! Oh, 
the shit. Yeah. Let me do it. Oh, I'm doing that. Get for the baby. Oh. I'm wasting bullets. This is what happens when you let an 11 year old drive a car. Too wide, what's going on there? Oh, I'm going the right way. Oh, yeah. What was that? Was that a walk out puppy? What's that? Oh, that was a walker, okay. Yeah, okay. Too cloudy. Oh, I see someone. Yep. She doesn't have the baby with her. What are you saying? No. 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 Not again. Not again. Glenn, look at me. No matter what happens, just stay out of it. Okay? Just trust me, Glenn. Out of what? What is she on about? You have to trust her. You're gonna see what he really is. What? Oh, she dead. She dead. Penny, calm down. Don't do anything stupid. Get out of my way. Oh, okay. 
Are you okay? He's alive. I understand if you're upset. AJ was never in any danger. I was just going to try to talk you into coming with me. I just thought if you saw Kenny like that, you'd know we'd have to leave him. Look, Clem, I'm sorry. I didn't think Kenny would go that far. But it's over now. We're all safe. We're going to be okay. Upset. You're fucking crazy. How could you do this? I had to do it, Clem. You saw how he reacted. I had to show you what he was capable of. So you put AJ in danger and got my friend killed just to prove a point? It was a stupid plan. I should never have lied to you. But I thought it was the only way you'd see. Oh my god. Kenny, you have to forgive me. Please. We can just leave all this behind us. Please. I did it for you, Clem. For us. We're free now. No, no, no. I'm not going anywhere with you. Clem. Please. I did this for you. I can't do this alone. Okay? Is that what you want to hear? Clem? Wow. Wow, that was something. Yeah. That was the baby. <laughs> yes, we did. Nice. Wasn't to have Luke. Yeah, we did, but he still died. Sad. Asked to live with Mike. Nope. <laughs> Obviously not. Shot Kenny. Shot Kenny. Yeah, yes, we did. Sadly. In the end, who were you with? You in the place along with AJ. Damn, people, uh, what? people don't want to be alone. Okay. I think that ending makes more sense. Wow, episode five. That's
said. Okay, that's the end of the video, episode episode 5, so it's all done now. So yeah, I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye. Peace.